The Boreal Chamber Symphony will make its debut on Lake Superior Day in Marquette, Michigan in a dramatic concert to protect America's largest freshwater lake. The concert will begin at 7 p.m. on Sunday, July 15, 2007 at the Upfront and Company restaurant in Marquette, Michigan, preceded by a social hour at 6. With a water and environment theme, the concert is sponsored by the Superior Watershed Partnership and the Cedar Tree Institute. Classical music as well as new music composed for the concert by uh, well-known Upper Peninsula musician Evan Primo, as well as a piece called Elements. Uh, and you see some of the instruments which appear in the Elements uh, composition uh, with Jim Strain and Carrie Violo. Also dance artist uh, Maria Formolo will depict the aspects and more perhaps deeper metaphysical uh, aspects of life around and relating to Lake Superior. The concert for Lake Superior features a wide range of classical and also contemporary new music which honors and features Lake Superior, including elements of the lake itself and elements created by uh, Marquette percussionist James Strain and Kerry Biolo. The trio put on a demonstration. Uh, we are also playing uh, the water music uh, by, our, by Georg Frederick Handel and a, Mozart, a short Mozart symphony, as well as two pieces by uh, composers from the Baltic region, which is a bit like a European Great Lake. Kari Tika, the Finnish composer, a piece called Exultate, and by the very famous contemporary Estonian composer Arvo Pert, a piece called Fratris, which translates as fraternal. Also on the program, a rather lengthy piece uh, from a French horn duo and the creation of uh, the new pieces in pieces by uh, a new piece by Evan Primo called Fall Storm on Lake Superior. Primo comes from a long time Upper Peninsula musical family. A lifelong Iron County resident, Primo studies double bass performance and composition at the University of Michigan. Primo has played with numerous orchestras and in February 2005 performed his own arrangement of Finnish folk songs at the Washington DC Kennedy Center. Conductor Craig Randall Johnson and and those musicians want to bring awareness to ecological issues. We have only one environment, and that's our planet. And we have this wonderful, immense body of water, which serves us in so many ways. It serves us economically and spiritually, and touches everyone who lives anywhere near it. And uh, we need to uh, nurture the lake and preserve it and and help the ecosystem that surrounds the lake and the music and the art brings a connection between people and the environment and the lake and this is what we are highlighting and featuring on this concert we depend on this water for uh, drinking for recreation we enjoy swimming in its waters we we enjoy fishing in the rivers that feed into Lake Superior so at the Watershed Partnership, we care about the bigger picture of the water. This is this is our resource. This is every day we we use the water from Lake Superior, and so we have to protect it. Tell me what your message would be to the Canadian musician. The concert for Lake Superior, uh, which we are presenting in Marquette, is uh, is what we hope will be the first of other programs of its type, which reflect and impact. Uh, the work people have on Lake Superior uh, in preserving and enhancing uh, the environment of the lake and surrounding area. And of course Lake Superior is an international body of water and we hope and would encourage groups in especially Thunder Bay and Sault Ste. Marie and other communities on Lake Superior to uh, 
put on concerts or festivals which support initiatives uh, promoting the health of the lake. Tell me what you want Canadians to know about. Well, I think that the, what we're doing here in Marquette to celebrate Lake Superior Day with a concert is, is something that any community around Lake Superior could do in Canada or the U.S. And we hope that, we'll, that this event can be a model for other communities to be able to celebrate this special day um, because we all share a, a very similar resource. We all, we all share Lake Superior. We all use its waters and we, we hope that this can be a model. In 2004, the Lake Superior Binational Forum designated the third Sunday in each July as Lake Superior Day in the United States and Canada. The concert received a $1,500 grant from the Marquette Community Foundation. Here's Marquette Community Foundation board member Martha Conley. Well, we really are a true believer in the community and in the, um, in the Lake Superior. And so we wanted this um, venue to help support um, the numerous groups that are helping um, keep Lake Superior as beautiful as it is for our community. So don't forget to attend the debut of the Boreal Chamber Symphony. The concert will begin at 7 p.m. on Sunday, July 15, 2007 at the Upfront and Company Restaurant in Marquette, Michigan, preceded by a social hour at 6. I'm Greg Peterson, and you're watching Earthkeeper Television.